Yeah, looking back on it now, it was nervous times. Obviously, when you go put your name forward for the draft, you can end up anywhere in Australia. So being from West Australia, there was only two teams that I could stay home with, so my chances weren't great. I actually went to the draft at the convention centre with my mum and dad, and yeah, in the space of about two hours, I was moving over to Melbourne. So to come over here to the big smoke for that opportunity was fantastic, and um, yeah, really enjoyed it. It's a real balancing act, you know, you, you spend probably a whole junior child life trying to work towards this dream of playing AFL football and then realise that it's probably not going to last forever and you need to open yourself up to other aspects of life and I was fortunate enough to do the first year program run through AFL Sports Ready and that was a really good foundation to, to keep my studies open after that. You know, the seriousness of injuries and how easily they can happen and how easy a football career can finish. So I wasn't naive in the fact that football does have an end date. So I finished up at Carlton after five years and unfortunately um, got the chop. So I was lucky enough to get a second chance by West Coast. Probably at that stage in my career that things hadn't worked to plan in my five years at Carlton and the importance of life after footy was really starting to kick in. For me, it was the kick up the bum I needed to, to really get proactive and did a diploma in sports development, leadership and management. Really started to, to be more proactive in life after footy and life in footy and transitioning. It brings a great balance to your life. The flexibility to learn and is not as rigid as, say, a uni course. I think the resources are improving every day for AFL players to continue their studies outside of football. Player development, well-being and um, welfare is something I'm really passionate about at the moment. I just finished an executive course giving aspiring player development and welfare managers the skill set to, to get into that space. It certainly wasn't concrete, it's still changing today, but to have a plan there to help has been fantastic. My name's Kane Lucas and Bet has provided me with a great foundation for a career after football.